What is up, guys? We're back. We're doing a little bit more Minecraft. Um, I've been streaming this new world. Uh, this is the first, like, kind of YouTube video that I'm making in this single-player world, but, you know, it's cool. Uh, I'll be editing some, uh, some of the Twitch VODs and putting them on YouTube as well. So far, we have this nice little iron farm. We have a little villager trader uh, thing going on over here. We have some cows, we have some chickens, we have some wheat. I have a, uh, a cave spider spawner as well that I kind of set up. Um, today, I want to be working on expanding this little villager trader hall and getting a villager breeder going. So that's going to be fun. Okay, so we did have a bit of an oopsie with some of my villagers in here. Um, some doofus left this little hole open that a little baby zombie could fit through, and yeah, now they're all zombies. So we have to convert them back into zombie villagers, or not zombie villagers, into normal villagers. Um, and so, yeah, no, that'll be interesting. I started gathering some of the resources that I need for that. Um, but I don't have all the resources, specifically... Let's see. So I have the spider eyes. I have uh, the sugar, brown mushrooms, um, golden apples, fermented spider eyes. You know, apples, gold, all that fun stuff. Because we need to make potions of weakness, and then we need to feed them golden apples. However, I can't make the potions because I need blaze powder. I guess we're heading out over to the Nether. These little bastards hit so hard. Try to sneak up on you, we have gas around. If you're wondering, I am like six inches away from my nether portal. This place is dangerous. Find you little bastard. What are those? Update. They are aggressive. I don't know if you're wondering, but uh, yeah. Yeah, they add them instantly. I don't like it. Why did I get close? I can't let you get close. Ooh. Drop leather. Oh yeah, brother. Oh, so there's like little villages. Maybe that's why there's so many of them around. Is this a village? Or are they just trees? I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. I also don't know what the hell that thing is. Looks safe, though. Okay, update. I was not feeling comfortable with the state of things. So I started digging a tunnel. But look at this. You guys thought I was stupid, but look at this! going. Boom. We done did it, guys. We done did it. Now, we have to not die. Which it happens to be a specialty of mine. So, uh... Ooh. That shit is exactly what we're looking for. Isn't it? Shit. Fuck. I lied. Stay alive is not a special design. It just isn't. Bad. Okay. Okay. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Go. Hey, guys, stop freaking out. Stop. Copernicus. Oh my goodness. What, do you just run and kill him? You get, you get blaze rods, right? 
What a bastard. Okay, um, I need to make sure everybody and their mother knows that this is where I came from. One thing I can't do, get lost. Okay, I need this. I'm getting distracted. I'll be back with more updates. Oops. This is a place spawner. Alright, we're gonna do this. We're coming from behind now. What, the, what is going on? Oh, direct hit. We're in danger. We're not safe. We're not safe. Zombie pigment around. Do not want to hit them. I've been grinding for, I don't know, 20 minutes or so now? I have 15 blaze rods. Um, look how close this is. So, here is the spawner, okay? And we go all the way this way, and you see these torches, that's where I marked off, um, where my tunnel was. But yeah, we just go this way. And, uh, yeah, there's nothing dangerous over here. Why? Oh, one of those things. I actually don't know where my tunnel is. Yeah, so we just walk down here, and then my tunnel's just right up over here. So yeah, then we walk up here. And then this leads literally all the way back to my uh, portal. Okay, we are back from the nether, into the overworld, and now I'm trying to make potions of weakness. I think I need gunpowder, that should be, aha, and I think this will turn them into splash potions. Right, so potions of weakness. Uh, all right, let's send it. Uh, I'm, mistake. I messed up. I'm in danger. <laughs> no, please leave me alone. How long does this take? What's wrong with me? Why didn't I think that this would be a problem? Oh. You all need to calm down, okay? Okay. They're not shaking? Shouldn't they be shaking? Okay. We're going back to the drawing board. The audacity. After everything I've done for these guys. Unbelievable. Okay guys, we've had a bit of a rough go with it. They started actually converting into villagers, but they didn't do it at the same time. And uh, so they started turning the villagers back into zombie villagers. And it's been a bit of a fiasco, but... I finally managed to get them into their mine carts, which luckily isn't hard for us to get because we have an iron farm. Um, and then I tried the splash potions and the apples again. So they should be turning into villagers sometime soon. It's nighttime. I don't like that, but I can't sleep. This is monsters. Look, you're a you're a full-grown villager. Near my fortune two trade. One book. Or one uh, emerald? I didn't mean to do that. Oh no. That's awkward. I wonder if that matters. What are you? You're my efficiency five for one emerald in the book. Good one, son. Let's do it. Um, yeah, so. Some unfortunate news. 
I lost my sword and my ha. diamond armor. Which is unfortunate. Ha. I thought I fall through more of these than I care to admit, but whatever. Um, you know, we've, we've managed. Eventually. So we're just waiting on this guy. I hope I didn't mess it up and I threw a potion in his face. Did I just give him an apple again? Oh, I'm a little nervous. I don't know what's going on. It should be fine though. Um, yeah. So hopefully when I get all this sorted, I'll be back with some cool stuff and things. Apparently, you can't really do any cool stuff with this deep slate unless it's cobbled. And obviously, if only been mining deep slate with silk touch. So yeah. I need to cobble up some of this uh here deep slate. And I could start making cool buildings out of it. Okay, so I need this villager breeder to be a little ways away from my iron farm, but I don't want it to be super far away. Um so probably somewhere around over here I think will be sufficient. But now I gotta clear all this stuff out of the way. That's gonna take a while. I'll be back. Okay, guys. So, we have the villager breeder built. Basically, you know, you have this little catch chamber. Um, and then the villagers are going to be standing on top of this fence post. And there's a few beds around there. And there's some carpets and trap doors. So they kind of get stuck in here. And they just chill there and you feed them and they breed. And the little baby uh, falls through here and lands in here. He ends up growing up, and you know you get a bunch of them, and then you could just have a little minecart like come over here, and they'll pick one up. You could send them off to wherever you want. So this isn't too hard. Uh, now I just have to get the villagers over here. So that's kind of what I'm working on now. So we have the track ah. built. Just have to get the right villagers over to the breeder. So I want to keep this guy. The efficiency 5, dude. I'm gonna send this Fletcher. And my Fortune 2 guy. The way? Oh well, yeah, we're gonna... I don't know. Let's see how this works. Alright. My friend. Oh, and you're off. Uh, Let's get you. Uh, uh, right? Yeah. Uh, You're off. Uh, uh, I wonder if I should be sending them at the same time. That might be a mistake. Uh, uh, I'm gonna find out. Uh, uh yeah. I'm uh, using. I'm powering my power rails with redstone blocks because I'm a savage. Uh, uh, Hey guys, I think we got him. So, uh, tear all this down. And with any luck, they should just stay up there. Um, I think... We need to get them out. Uh, how do you find the hitbox? Which button is it? It ain't that button. Don't worry, guys, I'm a pro. So I think they should just stay up there. And then when the sun sets, we go to bed. And I take those blocks away. And then I think they're just stuck in here after that. Because then when they wake up, they pop up in here. Uh, yeah, we're going to see if it works. But I think they did it. Yeah, they went to sleep. But we're going to go to sleep. And then they should be stuck in there forever, and they're going to make little villager babies for us. It's going to be great. Let's see. I think I think it worked. I don't. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. Cool. Um. So uh, um, uh, it looks like they're not really on it, doesn't it? I think that's what it's supposed to look like. So now I need to get food. I need to make 
a bunch of food for them. Yeah, they're in there. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go back. I'm just gonna, I don't know, grind out a bunch of carrots. Get them some carrots, and I'll start making little babies. Okay, so... I used as much bone meal as I had, and I got oh, not even two stacks of carrots. So, I'm gonna give this to them. And see... What happens? Um... I'll hopefully start, you know, doing the thing. Yep, just like that. And then little babies should fall on through here. Whenever, whenever they're good and ready. And that's, yep, that's how it works. Awesome. Um, they're obviously not safe out here. So I'm gonna try to build like a nice little enclosure around them. Um, see how that turns out. So, I've been trying to build a structure for a little while here, and it kind of sucks. Um, I don't really know what to do about like this track situation. Maybe have two tracks? Just to make it more even, just have them like connect out here. That might be a good idea, I don't know. Um, I kind of like this whole situation, that's kind of cool. But yeah, the bill's kind of bland. I need to change it up a little bit. Um, but I think I'm going to take a break from this and head over and expand my sugarcane farm. Okay, so I added a few more modules. I have six now. So hopefully I'll be collecting a little bit more sugar cane a little bit faster while I kind of put together the rest of my villager stuff. Well, yeah, we'll see what happens. Okay, so this is what I've put together so far. I'm not sure how I feel about it, but it's not looking too bad. Uh, I want to add a little bit more of crimson wood. I might put it in as the floor. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what the villager breeder looks like so far. Uh, uh, oh yeah. Uh, I'm not super mad at it. Uh, uh, um, I might be able to just put that floor in and move on to some other stuff. In any case, that's all I have time for today. Uh, we got a lot done, we killed some blazes. We finished up our villager breeder. Hopefully next episode we could actually get the uh, villagers bred and we can get a trading center going. Uh, other than that, that's all I got for you guys. So feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you next time.